You know, it's been ages since I've had the chocolate lava cake. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. And if you're new here, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss a notification when we upload, which is every Monday. Yeah. And today we are making another co copycat recipe. We are making the Domino's chocolate lava cake, which I'm obsessed with. I know I say this for a lot of desserts, but it's true. I love it. I am not a big fan of Domino's pizzas in general. But uh, if you've seen our choco pizza review, you'll know that I had to. Yeah. <laughs> but I do love the lava cake. It's been one of my favorite desserts from a fast food chain. Yeah, and I had it like I had it the time it came out, which is like seven, eight years back, and I'm, I haven't had it since mainly because I don't care so much. <laughs> so yeah, so let's get into the video and let's see how it goes. So this is all the stuff you'll need, and it's pretty basic. This is some flour to which we, as usual, added the baking powder and soda. Uh, this is some yogurt. This is a no egg recipe, by the way, since Domino's has a no egg flour cake. Some caster sugar, you could also use powdered. Some butter. Dark chocolate, we're using compound. Cocoa powder. And some milk. So, the first thing you want to do is grab a large microwave safe bowl and put in all your chocolate and the butter, and you want to melt these down together. So the butter and the chocolate are all melted and now what you want to do is add in all of the sugar and whisk that through as well. After that, once the sugar is mixed through, you want to fold in the dry ingredients. So that's the flour with the powder soda and the cocoa powder. And once the dry ingredients are folded through, you just want to mix in the milk and the yogurt as well. So, this is somewhat what it looks like. It's a really thick batter. And uh, we just have a muffin tin here, which we've not lined, we've greased and flared this. If you have individual silicone ones, that'll be even easier to demold, of course. But this is what we are using. And you just want to fill all of them up. Um, these won't rise too much, so about three fourths full is good. And you want to bake these uh, for seven minutes precisely at 180 degrees Celsius. So yeah. So you saw the video, and it was really very simple to recreate, and it is a very quick dessert in my opinion. Yeah, it is. Uh, the only thing is the lava, it sets up for a bit. Uh, not completely, but it does get really, really thick. It won't flow yeah. as much. So make sure you uh, bake them right before serving. Since you have to bake them only for like 7 minutes, that's not a problem. Yeah, and if you are so making it for a later time, just reheat it for like 30 seconds before you give it to the guests. So I think it should be fine. Yeah, and Domino's doesn't do this, but I think that would taste amazing with some ice cream. Mm, I guess, yeah. So if you like the video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. And follow us on all our social media. The links are all given in the description box below. Yep. Bye and see you next time.